Welcome to the mix and on the mix we have Maxine. Now Maxine explains her situation with about Lorraine and her husband Steve and um, she's making it clear that um, Lorraine couldn't have spit in her food the time that they went out together. It must have been at a different point. So go ahead and watch the video and please remember to like, share and subscribe and if you have a business and you would like it to be um, advertise for free just drop your link down below. everybody agree we went to red lobster there was no food left back so we could bring back you understand there was no food we eat all and we leave so there was no bag Lorraine decided to pay the bill even though Maureen and Cynthia wanted to pay but they paid for the tipping the third trip that we met go, there was no food that bring back. The third trip was when me and my daughter, my daughter invited her out. And that was a disaster because all Lorraine did was order her sort of food that she can't even, she don't even know what she was ordering and take pictures and return them. That's all she did. It was an embarrassment that day. My daughter decided, listen, I'm gonna pay part of the bill and I'm gonna pay for the tip because I know they're not gonna tip these people. And we dashed for the door. That was it, there was no food bring back. So there was, get it clear, no food to spit in. There was no food to spit in. The two time, or might be three, Steve never go out with us because he's so afraid of COVID and he has underlying condition not for me to get in but he will never go out to sit at a restaurant and eat he's scared as hell he said to me what do i want to eat i said whatever you and lauren gonna eat he says listen it's not about lauren it's about you what you want whatever i buy lauren have to eat it so if you i buy something for you something for me lauren get from what i got we eat in the room like three times and I always take out a half of mine because I can't eat so much food. Lorraine know that I always bring stuff for my grandkid. It's not like she doesn't know that. I love my grandkids to death. No matter what I eat, I will always bring back home something for them. So Lorraine already know that. And in the video that I'm going to play, you will hear when she said she get up in the night and spit in the food. It's not that I eat and I take up all of Lorraine's food or Steve's food or anything like that. No, 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 no. It's nothing like that. Like literally nothing. There was no eat and left, nobody eat and left. She get to spit in there or whatever. She is the one who said she get up in the middle of the night and spit in the food and you will hear it on the tape. I'm gonna make sure I put it, make you hear it on the tape. So with everybody defending her saying, oh, she didn't spit in no food. She said she did. She said she did and she go as far as to said she shouldn't have shit in there. You understand? So don't be coming at me that I am jealous and I'm this and I'm that. And don't be beating everybody. The reason why I went on live and do that live, I was on legendary live when I, I, it didn't sit well with me. When I hear legendary say it's one for one, if me, the Lorraine grandkid, she go do it too. And nobody never see she spitting at the food and all of that. It came from her mouth. And he was saying stuff where I, it didn't sit well with me. So I'm the one who texted him and said, listen. I'm going to go on live now and I'm going to just play the tape so everybody could hear because apparently the one minute tape that I did on TikTok, nobody can hear it properly. They didn't understand nothing from it. So what I'm going to do is make it clear so everybody could understand. I was no push button for all who going to go blog and talk about legendary tell me to do this or Stacy tell me to do this or Ashanti tell me to do this or Donna tell me to do this get off of the people them back come off of the people them back nobody name push me if you go do nothing and yes i blame myself for every god almighty thing that happened i do blame myself and you guys will never see me cry again on social media never I cried because I mean, I can't get my, I'm frustrated and I can't get my facts out the way I wanted it to get out. So yes, I will take in, um, instruction from Legendary. I'll take it from Ashanti. I'll take it from anybody who, Stacy, anybody 
Lady V, anybody who wanted to give me instruction to do whatever I got to do, yes, I will take the information from them. So for you people to be on these people's back, that they're take is not that they're taking side. Nobody's taking my side. I think I'm the most hated person on social media. Nobody wants to take my side. But my God Almighty man, right is right and wrong is wrong. Whether I said it, she said it, and it comes from Lorraine's mouth. Lorraine said she did it. So who are we to say she didn't do it? Why is everybody so 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 blind? Why is everybody so blind? Come on, man. Legendary, I'm sorry that I have to be putting you in such problem. This is the second problem I put you in. Because, I mean, the first one you tried to clear my name and they bashed you about it. No, this again. And everything that you hear that woman said is a lie. It is a lie. I can prove it, but certain things you just can't come on social media with. Because then I will be putting myself in danger. I would be putting myself in problem. Where the bags and stuff come from? If I should come out and say what I need to say, and the, the plain truth about those things, I, I would be putting my life in jeopardy. I would be putting my life in jeopardy. And I'm not going to do that because none of you are not going to help me. None of you are not going to help me. You understand? So, uh, Legendary, I'm sorry. Lady V, I'm sorry. Stacy, I'm sorry. Because if it wasn't for me, you guys would not be getting the backlash that you're getting right now. This goes back to the same thing that happened two years ago. It's not that people want to be bashed and stuff like that, but for, you mean to be honest? They're going to kill you to be honest? Nobody said Lauren spit in the food. She did. She comes out and tell everybody she spit in there. Everybody she tells she spit in there. And not only did she spit in there, she would have shit in there if she get the chance to shit in there. She's the one who disrespected my grandkids and everybody. And for you people who out there dissing my daughter and my son, let me tell you something. My daughter and my son deal with jungle justice. If you ever knew my daughter and my son...